Did you know that nearly 80% of workers in the U.S. live paycheck to paycheck? That's a staggering majority. So if you've ever looked at the wealthy and pondered, what do they know that I don't? You're not alone. You have to do this to diverge from the norm and head towards genuine financial success. The truth is, you have to do certain things consistently to climb the ladder of financial success. Today, we're about to reveal the 10 money habits that are common among the richest people in the world. Let's dive into the world of financial legends like Warren Buffett, Charlie Munger, and Peter Lynch and uncover their secrets. Many of us face a common set of challenges, earning well but living paycheck to paycheck, being unsure of how to invest or watching our savings deplete with no substantial growth. I remember a story about Jane, a high-earning professional. Despite her income, she struggled with savings. It felt like every month she was starting from scratch. Sound familiar? But there's hope. The journey from where Jane was to financial freedom is paved with the habits of financial gurus. Let's delve into these habits. Number 1. Live Below Your Means Warren Buffett, one of the world's richest men, still resides in the house he bought in 1958 for $31,500. What does this teach us? Similarly, Carlos Slim, one of the world's wealthiest men, has lived in the same house for over 40 years. The lesson? True wealth doesn't need to be displayed. That wealth isn't about displaying affluence, but about managing resources intelligently. Instead of upgrading lifestyles with every salary hike, consider investing the surplus. Number 2. Continuous Learning Charlie Munger firmly believes in the compounding effect of knowledge. He said, go to bed smarter than when you woke up. Munger, despite his age, is known to constantly add to his lattice work of mental models. Similarly, Bill Gates reads about 50 books a year. This habit helps them stay ahead in the ever-evolving financial landscape. In today's rapidly changing financial world, what you knew yesterday might not be enough. Allocate time daily or weekly to read, learn, and grow. Number 3. Invest in what you understand Peter Lynch once said, During the gold rush, most would-be miners lost money. But people who sold picks, shovels, tents, and jeans made a nice profit. Investing in what you understand can give you a clearer vision of potential profits. Peter Lynch's investment strategy was simple. If you can't explain it simply, you don't know it well enough. Before diving into any investment, be it stocks, real estate, or startups, understand the ins and outs. This will prevent hasty decisions based on market hysteria. Number 4. Avoid debt Debt isn't evil, it's a tool. But like any tool, misuse can lead to disasters. While the rich use debt to leverage investments, they avoid bad debt. Debt that doesn't generate income or increase in value. Robert Kiyosaki, author of Rich Dad, Poor Dad, emphasizes the difference between good and bad debt. He recalls how his rich dad would leverage debt to build assets while his poor dad accumulated liabilities. Number 5. Diversify, but not too much. The essence here is balance. You want to spread your risks across multiple investments. However, diversifying too much can dilute potential gains and make managing your portfolio a nightmare. Mark Cuban, billionaire and owner of the Dallas Mavericks, once said, Diversification is for idiots. While it's essential to spread your risks, over-diversification can lead to mediocre returns. Number 6. Think long-term. Buffett's philosophy has always been clear. If you aren't willing to own a stock for 10 years, don't even think about owning it for 10 minutes. In an era of instant gratification, this is a reminder that true wealth building is a long game. Jeff Bezos, the founder of Amazon, is known for his long-term thinking. He often speaks about making decisions based on where things will be in a few years, not where they are now. Number 7. Network with the right people Andrew Carnegie, one of history's wealthiest figures, attributed much of his success to his ability to surround himself with talented people. He believed in the principle that your net worth often reflects your network. Number 8. Stay physically and mentally fit Richard Branson, founder of the Virgin Group, wakes up at 5 a.m. to work out. He believes that physical fitness boosts his productivity and enhances his mental well-being, directly impacting his business decisions. Number 9. Be persistent and embrace failures Oprah Winfrey, now a media mogul, was once fired from her job as a TV reporter. Instead of giving up, she embraced her failures, persisted, and built an empire. Her journey reinforces the idea that setbacks are just setups for bigger comebacks. Number 10. Self-discipline Financial success isn't about making that one lucky move. 
It's about consistent, disciplined actions over time. Set financial goals, prioritize them, and resist the urge to deviate. Elon Musk, despite his multiple ventures, is known for his rigorous discipline and work ethic. He once said, if other people are putting in 40-hour work weeks and you're putting in 100-hour work weeks, you'll achieve in four months what it takes them a year. If you're finding this deep dive insightful, remember to subscribe to our page. Your journey to financial wisdom has just begun. How do you incorporate these habits? Let's break it down. Start by analyzing your monthly expenses. Identify areas where you can cut down. Maybe that extra streaming service you barely use? Dedicate a part of your day to financial growth. It could be a podcast during your commute or a chapter of a financial book before bed. Before investing, ask basic questions. What does this company do? How do they earn money? What are their challenges? Create a list of debts. Prioritize them based on interest rates. Aim to clear high interest debts first. Diversify, but remain within your circle of competence. If you understand tech stocks, start there. If real estate is your thing, delve deeper into that. When tempted to make hasty investment decisions based on market news, take a step back. Think about the long-term implications. Finally, create a vision board or a financial goal sheet. Regularly review and remind yourself why you started this journey. In today's deep dive, we've unlocked the pathways to wealth, learned from the best, and explored the 10 habits that define financial giants. Number one, frugality. Number two, continuous learning. Number three, knowledgeable investments. Number four, prudent debt management. Number five, smart diversification. Number six, long-term vision. Number seven, discipline. Number eight, networking. Number nine, health as wealth. And number 10, embracing figures. Remember, the stark reality is that nearly 80% of workers in the U.S., Live paycheck to paycheck. It's a challenging cycle, but with consistent habits and a shift in mindset, you can transition from this majority. Take the leap. Start today. Whether it's saving that extra dollar or reading that financial book, every step counts. Break away from the 80% and carve your own financial journey. Share your progress and inspire others. Hit like, share, and ensure you're subscribed for more transformative insights. Thank you for investing time with us today. The journey to financial freedom is paved with knowledge. To further empower yourself, watch our suggested videos next. Together, let's change the narrative and build a prosperous future.